Hey everybody, it's yours truly, Mr. Lang, Team Wash Life. We're out here doing our second frat house quote for a house wash. This is our second one, ain't it, man? Oh yeah. Look how nice coat looks. Looks like a real life estimator. Look at the shoes, beat the shoes. Proud of the little grasshopper. He went from grass smoker to grasshopper. How about that? So. All right, so doing an estimate like this in person, you know, brick, checking for calcium deposits and stuff. Um, but when quoting stuff like this, especially like really for any commercial, we're gonna give them two different prices. This is how I do it at least. Price number one is gonna be more of a basic cleaning, freshen everything up, get rid of the dirt, organic growth, cobwebs, freshen it all up, clean it up, sterilize, good to go. And then we're gonna take more in-depth photos of a little bit more detail. So maybe there's some rust stains, oxidation on the gutters, um, or calcium deposits, what have you. We're gonna take little pictures of all that, include it in our estimate, and give them a second quote saying, you know, in-depth cleaning or premium cleaning, you know, with a price tag way higher, um, saying, you know, we can get rid of all these, you know, these other stains that are non-organic. Um, gives them a lot more option, a little more flexibility, and then you can kind of figure out what kind of client you're dealing with. Um, a client on a budget or a client who really wants to, you know, restore their property as, as much as they can. So, I thought that was a good tip. You're welcome. It's yours truly, Mr. Lang, Team Wash Life. Oh, wow. I just, I, we parked across the street. I walked right across. I'm like, where's Colt? He went all the way to a crosswalk across the street. What a brown noser. Care to tell the people what we're doing here today? Well, we're putting in a quote to the courthouse. You gotta talk louder because it's windy. All right, we're quoting the courthouse in Sycamore. All the windows, the house wash. House wash? This isn't a house. Or this isn't the White House. Building wash. <laughs> South Walsh. South Walsh. Let's reveal what this monster looks like. What theme music should go on behind this? Rocky? Or should it be? The yellow thing we were just listening to. Oh, nice. Copyright problems though, you know? Sure, sure. So, you guys, this is limestone. This is a whole nother beast. A whole lot of research would need to be done. I'm talking to some high-level people who have done high-level stuff, but you don't clean limestone like you typically do with soft wash, house wash. From what I know, you use special chem, expensive chem, and uh, we need a whole lot of it for something like this. But I don't know if you could tell, this front part is the original, and over here was actually an addition they did within the last 10 years, I'd say, seven years ago maybe. So they're really interested in the windows, exterior windows, um, but they're also interested in getting the tops clean. Well, the building clean, as you can tell, it's very black, nasty. Over there, it's clean. So very honored to have this opportunity. Colt looks way better for estimates than I do. That's for damn sure. Oh yeah, we came prepared today, boys. Yeah. So we're basically just gonna go around, count the windows, try to assess how bad they are, how much scrubbing we'll need done. Again, it's just the exteriors. Hopefully we can water fed pull this beast in and out, call her a day, pitter patter, let's get at her. And that's it. You can really see the difference in the limestone. Or I mean, it's a drop down over there. This is a 50 to 75 foot tall building. Uh, window cleaning. This is the new, this is the old. You can see the difference. Check out the trim. I know the sun's really bad. The trim is just black. The building's like darker and this is all white. And even that trim's starting to get dirty but not nearly as bad as this. Until it's never been clean. There's even stuff up on the roof. So, all right.
What do you think, YouTube?